The Celtics take on the Bucks game four. And that's going to be a 7.30 Eastern tip-off on Monday, May 9th, 2022. Milwaukee's up two games to one in the series. They're also the one-point favorite at home with the total at 210.5. And, and speaking of the total in this one, all three of this series games fell under the posted number. As a matter of fact, the Bucks are currently 8-0 to the under in the uh, postseason here this year. Uh, they haven't seen one over since the playoffs started. Meanwhile, the Celtics on the other side of things, they saw five out of their last six fall under the posted total themselves. When it comes to selecting a winner in this one, this game's being featured as my NBA tier package bet on BrockPage.com for Monday. So if you want to see whether I like the Celtics in a bounce back spot, or if I like the Bucks getting the job done on their home court, there's only one way to find out, and that's to sign up for my NBA tier package bet on BrockPage.com. But as far as making a free pick goes, I'm going to lean toward the under 210.5 in that ball game. And with that, guys, let's go ahead and jump into our next and final matchup for the video. It is going to be Grizzlies taking on the Warriors game four. That's going to be a 10 o'clock Eastern start time. Golden State's up 2-1 to one in the series here. They're also minus nine, total 227. But before you go ahead and write off Memphis in the series, just keep in mind that these guys played at an extremely high level without Ja Morant, uh, you know, when he was injured earlier in the year. And as a matter of fact, most experts would say they actually played better team basketball without Ja on the floor. Now, when it comes to covering the number, the Grizzlies have been excellent covering the number on the road this year. They're 28 and 17 against the spread while traveling, and that's good for over 62% in that category. And when it comes to the scoring in this one, the Grizzlies are still averaging more points per contest than any other team in the NBA right now. Now, Desmond Bain, he's been absolutely scary from three land. He's drilling nearly 47% of his three pointers in the playoffs, and he's also averaging 19 points a night. Meanwhile, Jaron Jackson Jr. is scoring over 14.5 points a game in the playoffs himself, along with seven boards. And speaking of rebounds, Memphis is also leading the NBA right now in offensive rebounding per contest. They're taking on a Warriors team who failed to cover in four out of their last five themselves, and they've actually struggled covering against Memphis in recent meetings. Golden State's just three and seven against the number in their last 10 contests against the Grizzlies. When it comes to the total in this one, the Warriors have gone four and one of the over in their last five ball games as the official home favorite. They're also seven and three to the over in their last 10 outings at any location. Meanwhile, the Grizzlies have gone 25 and 20 to the over when they travel. I'm going to lean toward Memphis plus nine in the over 227. 